Hi, my name is Natalie Munoz. I'm a training specialist here at Beck Technology, and I'm going to talk about why I wish we'd had Estimator when I worked with a GC. So one thing would have been um, we bid on a lot of similar buildings with a very specific client, and we were always comparing the different buildings between each other. Um, it would have been great to be able to look back at the historical data and look at previous projects that were similar in size, but not necessarily in the same location and compare the costs and, and even the quantities of the different uh, line items that were in the bid. It would have saved us a lot of time and energy flipping back and forth between Excel um, and actually trying to hunt down all of those estimates as well. So one great thing that I think um, estimator brings to the table is the use of assemblies. Um, coming from the field and then being a junior estimator, I didn't always know all the different parts and pieces of, let's say, a roof or a wall system. Um, having those assemblies pre-made, looking for insulation, stud uh, size, type of jit board, the finish, all of the things, especially to someone who either hasn't come from the field or is new to estimating junior estimators, we don't know to look for those things automatically unless we're taught. Um, having an assembly is a really great way to check what you're doing. Um, it's the great ability to say yes or no and run down and make sure that you have everything. So that would have been a time saver and a great way to learn about a roof system or a wall or a concrete slab. But I also think just Especially for companies that bid with the same type of building or the same client, it can become just this huge undertaking to basically recreate the wheel every time. Um, and something that the client that we worked with, they would change one or two things and it was different between each building, but you had to know where to look to see which one was different. Um, if you already know those differences and the things that they're going to hit you with, it's really easy just to check the line item, check the assembly, and run through it really quickly. Um, mm -hmm. But the main issue is you don't know what you don't know. So until you find something, until you've been burned, basically, you don't know to look for something specific. Um, I think Estimator would eliminate a lot of that. Um, people who don't have estimator just wish they could see how much time they're going to save. Um, being able to already load your estimate with line items and not have to transfer that from your estimating software to your Excel, um, massive amounts of time. And then it's all connected. So you know what each of your team members is doing all the time. Um, you're seeing their progress. There's, it, it really eliminates a lot of questions. I know where I worked, we would finish our takeoffs, finish scoping our bids, and then have to go in and have a meeting with the lead estimator. And that took all day. Um, you don't have to do that here. It's it's all web-based it's, or it's, it's in a database. So you're able to, um, they're able to see what you're inputting, especially with bid day. They can see all your subs. They can see what's being marked as included, what's missing, what's a risk. Everything just flows. It, it just, it would save so much time.